Hi everybody, today's focus, I am testing Branch Basics All-Purpose Cleaner to see how well it removes bacteria from my home. My viewer Julie reached out to me and asked if she could mail me three different cleaners for me to test. I said absolutely send them away. One of the cleaners that she mailed me was the Branch Basics All-Purpose Cleaner. Julie is not the only person who has asked me to test Branch Basics. I got requests from Mary Buggy, Elias Campuzano, Caroline Tom, Sewing Graham. Wait for that airplane to go by. Alyssa Puffer, Jen, Here to Tell, Lanes, J.E.L. Medeas. Ah, uh, San, Max Panda, Taylor Walker, Cindy Rodriguez, Tanya at Mom's Small Victories, and others. So I'm happy to be able to test this product for my viewers. So Branch Basics is a company that creates non-toxic cleaners, and I believe most of them are plant-based. In order to reduce plastic waste, they do mail you a reusable bottle so that when you purchase more cleaner, all you get is this small concentrated bottle. Reading the bottle, it says the power of pure, human safe, biodegradable, branch basics, plant and mineral based. And again, this is the all purpose spray. It says they have no nuts or tree nuts, it's hypoallergenic, it's non toxic, no alcohols or synthetic preservatives. I do want to point out that Branch Basics is a cleaner. It is not classified as a disinfectant or a sanitizer. They actually have an FAQ question and answer where they address this. The question is, are Branch Basics cleaning products antibacterial? Does it disinfect? And their answer is, Branch Basics is not a disinfectant, sanitizer, or antibacterial soap. Sanitizers and disinfectants work to kill germs while leaving them in place, which can actually kill good bacteria and create resistant superbugs when germs don't die. Instead, Branch Basics removes germs versus killing them, which is the best way to clean under normal circumstances. Only rarely is sanitizing or disinfecting necessary. That is, when preparing raw meat or after a family member has the flu. To read more about the science behind this, check out our post, Does Branch Basics Kill Germs? In fact, the CDC recommends opting for plain soap and water to remove germs in your home instead of using a sanitizer. So I want to make it very clear that Branch Basics does not claim to be able to kill bacteria, but they do claim to be able to remove it. So in order to test how well Branch Basics removes bacteria, what I'm going to do is take a petri dish just like this guy here and label it A, B, and C. I'm going to take some sterile swabs and swab various areas around my home, including the kitchen sink, kitchen sink drain, bathroom sink, and toilet rim. I'll place that sample in the section labeled B for before. Then I'll clean according to the Branch Basics directions, which we'll read in a minute, swab the area again, and place that sample in the section labeled A for after. C is my control, nothing goes there. So let's read how we're supposed to use the Branch Basics all-purpose spray. So the first thing I notice is that I have an empty bottle in a concentrated bottle. So what I'll do is just follow the directions. It says fill the water to the water line. Add the concentrate to the soap line. Slowly top off with water. Okay, that's good, that's easy enough. Then to use on surfaces, spray and wipe clean. For tough jobs, let sit for one to five minutes. If you're using it to remove stains, it says to spray, let sit, agitate, and for tough ones, soak overnight. Now we're just testing hard surfaces, so I'm going to follow the original directions, which is to spray and wipe clean. So let's see how well the Branch Basics All-Purpose Spray removes bacteria from my home.
Now for some results. Let's look at the kitchen sink. In the before section, we can see a lot of bacteria. That's a good sampling of bacteria. And in the after section, there are like three or four very teeny tiny small bacterial colonies. So the Branch Basics did an excellent job at removing the bacteria from my kitchen sink. The kitchen sink drain. In the before section, we can see a lot of bacteria and we can see different types as well. And in the after section, we can still see quite a bit of growth um, on the dish. Now, if I'm looking really closely, I can see that there's a big decrease in the very small, tiny bacterial colonies uh, between the before and the after. But overall, there's still a lot of growth in the after section. So the Branch Basics didn't do a good job at all at removing the bacteria from my kitchen sink drain. The bathroom sink. In the before section, we can see a lot of bacteria in different types as well. And in the after section, we're still seeing quite a bit of bacteria. I'm not noting a huge visible decrease at all. So the Branch Basics did not do a good job at removing the bacteria from my bathroom sink. The toilet rim. In the before section, we have a tremendous amount of bacteria with a huge smearing of bacteria. And in the after section, we have a huge decrease in bacteria. We've only got four small bacterial colonies there in the after section. So the Branch Basics did an excellent job at removing the bacteria from my toilet rim. Overall, we're seeing some mixed results from the Branch Basics Cleaner when it comes to removing bacteria throughout the home. We started to do a good job of removing bacteria in the kitchen sink and also the toilet rim, but it didn't do a good job at all in the kitchen sink drain and the bathroom sink. But Branch Basics is just a cleaner. It is not a disinfectant. It is not a sanitizer. Now they do have some things that say that yeah, the soap can you know, remove bacteria, but it's not classified at all as a sanitizer or a disinfectant. Oftentimes when people are cleaning their home, they'll use a cleaner first. Something like a Branch Basics or a um, Dr. Bronner's or a Salsud, something with soap, right? A cleaner. And that's really to just remove the dirt and grime and that surface yuck off of wherever it is you're cleaning, let's say the kitchen sink. And then if they're looking to remove bacteria from the area, that's when they'll hit the area with a sanitizer or a disinfectant. So we can't expect cleaners to be able to remove all bacteria because that's not what they're supposed to do. Now as for the scent of the Branch Basics All Purpose Cleaner, there is none. There is no scent at all. So if you're someone who's looking for a cleaner that has zero scent, this is a great one. I will say as I was cleaning uh, my sink and cleaning other areas in my home, the dirt and grime did wipe off very easily. So it is, I think, a very effective cleaner. I think the Branch Basics is also a good product if you're looking for something that is plant-based and mineral-based. Also, if you're looking for something that has a refill system where you keep this bottle and then you only purchase a little small bottle to refill. So thank you, Julie, for mailing me the Branch Basics All-Purpose Cleaner. I really have been interested in testing this one out and I'm glad I was able to. I think it is a good cleaner and I will use it in my home when I'm doing cleaning, but not quite when I'm looking to disinfect or sanitize surfaces. If you have a product that you would like me to test, do me a favor and put it in the comments section and I will add it to my viewer suggestion list or you can do what Julie did and mail me a product. Just do me a favor and send me an email first. Let's talk about it before you send it to me just in case I have it in my home already and it's like waiting to be tested and then you can mail it to me. My mailbox address is in the description of all of my videos. I hope you enjoyed this video. Take care, have yourselves a great day.